The reverberations of a seismic shift are rumbling through the global motorcycle industry. The once thriving market, with its roaring engines and adventurous spirit, now stands at the precipice of a historic downturn. What was once a symbol of freedom and rebellion now faces a grim reality. The biggest motorcycle market crash in history has just begun. Before we start, please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more updates. For decades, motorcycles have held a special place in the hearts of enthusiasts worldwide. From the iconic Harley-Davidson to the sleek designs of Ducati and the reliability of Honda, these machines have been more than just modes of transportation. They've been symbols of identity and freedom. But as economic, cultural, and technological tides shift, the landscape of the motorcycle industry is changing rapidly, and not for the better. One of the primary drivers of this market crash is the changing demographics of riders. Traditionally, motorcycles have been associated with a younger, thrill-seeking demographic. However, in recent years, younger generations have shown less interest in motorcycle ownership. Rising concerns about safety, environmental consciousness, and the availability of alternative forms of transportation, such as electric scooters and ride-sharing services, have all contributed to a decline in motorcycle sales among younger consumers. Moreover, the aging population of existing riders poses a significant challenge to the industry. As baby boomers who have been a core demographic for motorcycle manufacturers, age out of riding or reduce their riding frequency due to health concerns, the industry is losing a sizable portion of its customer base. Attempts to attract younger riders through marketing campaigns and new product lines have had limited success, further exacerbating the industry's woes. Another factor driving the motorcycle market crash is the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic. The pandemic disrupted supply chains, manufacturing operations, and consumer behavior worldwide. Lockdown measures and economic uncertainties led to a sharp decline in discretionary spending, with many consumers prioritizing essentials over recreational purchases like motorcycles. Even as economies reopen, the lingering effects of the pandemic continue to dampen consumer confidence and spending habits, further stifling the recovery of the motorcycle market. The rise of electric vehicles, EVs, poses a formidable challenge to traditional motorcycle manufacturers. Electric motorcycles offer numerous advantages over their gas-powered counterparts, including lower operating costs, reduced environmental impact, and simplified maintenance. Companies like Zero Motorcycles and Harley-Davidson's Livewire have been at the forefront of this shift towards electric mobility. However, the transition to electric is not without its hurdles, including concerns about range, charging infrastructure, and the high initial cost of electric motorcycles. Nonetheless, as EV technology continues to improve and become more affordable, traditional motorcycle manufacturers face increasing pressure to adapt or risk becoming obsolete. In addition to demographic shifts and technological advancements, regulatory changes are also impacting the motorcycle industry. Stricter emission standards, particularly in regions like Europe and Asia, are pushing manufacturers to develop cleaner and more fuel-efficient vehicles. While these regulations are necessary for mitigating environmental impact, they pose significant challenges for traditional motorcycle manufacturers, many of whom rely on large displacement, gas-guzzling models for their profitability. Adapting to these regulations requires substantial investment in research and development, which can strain the financial resources of companies already grappling with declining sales and profitability. The global economic landscape further compounds the challenges facing the motorcycle industry. Economic downturns, trade disputes, and geopolitical tensions have created an uncertain business environment, making it difficult for manufacturers to forecast demand and plan for the future. Supply chain disruptions, such as those caused by the COVID-19 pandemic and geopolitical conflicts, have also exposed vulnerabilities in the industry's reliance on global manufacturing and distribution networks. Rising material costs and inflationary pressures further squeeze profit margins, forcing companies to make difficult decisions about pricing, production, and investment. As the motorcycle market grapples with these multifaceted challenges, industry players must rethink their strategies to survive and thrive in the face of adversity. Diversification of product offerings, including entry into adjacent markets such as electric bicycles and personal mobility devices, may provide new revenue streams and opportunities for growth. 
Embracing sustainability and innovation, particularly in the development of electric and hybrid models, can help manufacturers stay competitive in a rapidly evolving market. Strengthening partnerships with governments, industry stakeholders, and advocacy groups can also facilitate the adoption of favorable policies and regulations that support the long-term viability of the motorcycle industry. However, the road ahead remains fraught with uncertainty, and not all players will emerge unscathed from the looming motorcycle market crash. Consolidation, restructuring, and even bankruptcies may be inevitable as companies grapple with declining sales, mounting debt, and fierce competition. The once revered icons of the motorcycle world may find themselves on shaky ground as they confront the harsh realities of a changing market landscape. The repercussions of the ongoing motorcycle market crash extend beyond just the manufacturers themselves. They reverberate throughout the entire ecosystem of riders, dealerships, aftermarket suppliers, and enthusiasts. Dealerships once bustling with activity and excitement now find themselves grappling with dwindling foot traffic and stagnant inventory turnover. Many dealers are being forced to diversify their offerings or explore alternative revenue streams to stay afloat in an increasingly challenging market environment. For aftermarket suppliers and service providers, the downturn in motorcycle sales translates to reduced demand for parts, accessories, and maintenance services. As fewer riders hit the road, the need for replacement parts and upgrades diminishes, leading to decreased revenue for businesses that rely on aftermarket sales. Service centers, too, are feeling the pinch as fewer customers seek routine maintenance and repairs for their motorcycles. The ripple effects of the market crash are felt far and wide, touching every corner of the motorcycle industry ecosystem. Enthusiasts, once the lifeblood of the motorcycle community, are also grappling with the changing landscape of the industry. For many, the allure of motorcycling lies not just in the act of riding itself, but in the sense of camaraderie and belonging that comes with being part of a vibrant community. However, as motorcycle ownership declines and riding becomes less popular among younger generations, enthusiasts are facing the prospect of a shrinking community and dwindling support for their passion. The cultural significance of motorcycles as symbols of freedom, rebellion, and individuality is also at risk of being diluted in the face of changing consumer preferences and societal norms. As younger generations gravitate towards alternative forms of transportation and leisure activities, the once iconic image of the lone rider on an open road may become increasingly rare, relegated to the annals of history. Despite these challenges, there is still hope for the future of the motorcycle industry. While the current market crash may signal the end of an era for traditional manufacturers, it also presents an opportunity for innovation and reinvention. Emerging players in the electric and alternative mobility sectors are challenging the status quo and pushing the boundaries of what is possible in the world of motorcycles. From sleek electric bikes to futuristic personal mobility devices, the next generation of vehicles promises to revolutionize the way we think about transportation and mobility. The spirit of motorcycling, adventure, freedom, and self-expression remains alive and well in the hearts of enthusiasts around the world. While the means of achieving these ideals may evolve over time, the underlying ethos of the motorcycle community perseveres, undeterred by market forces or economic uncertainties as long as there are riders willing to embrace the thrill of the open road. The legacy of motorcycles will endure, transcending market cycles and economic downturns. In the face of the biggest motorcycle market crash in history, the industry must come together to chart a path forward that ensures its survival and relevance in the years to come. Collaboration, innovation, and a steadfast commitment to the core values of motorcycling will be essential in overcoming the challenges that lie ahead. While the road may be fraught with obstacles, the resilience and determination of the motorcycle community are boundless, offering hope for a brighter and more prosperous future, no matter what twists and turns may lie ahead. If you like this video, please give it a like and subscribe to our channel. Also, leave your comments below and tell us. What do you foresee as the future of the motorcycle market following this crash? We want to hear from you. Thank you for watching and see you next time.